Bucks didn't spend any time in the spotlight last season. They went 0-10, scoring just 52 total points on the year. Now a new head coach will try to rebuild the proud program. Honestly, I tried to forget about it. That was a rough time. <laughs> but it doesn't feel rough for new head coach Jeremy Boskin. I'm loving every single day of it so far. What's Jeremy Boskin brought to Boyd in Canada in your opinion? Um, I think he's brought like a lot of hype and a lot of like effort into the team. He's brought like a new mentality this year. This was the hardest working summer I think anyone has had in a while here. We've just been working hard, and he's like really changed the tone of the program this year. He's trying to get our confidence back up. Like he's trying to let us know that we're not the same team that we were last year. Yeah. We can we can be something special this year. Is what he's trying to tell us. We try to preach to our kids that whenever we cross that white line, they can be anybody they want to be, and we're not worried about who's on the other side. We're going to do our jobs. We're going to take care of our brother and try to take care of business like the Bucks of old. Boyd Buchanan has missed the playoffs only three times since '96 and they've appeared in four state title games. And the tradition is something that we tr are doing our best to embrace and build back. That from the alumni we've met and the pride they take in this place and the, just the stories I've heard about what Friday nights like are here. Like dinosaurs running on the field, although Coach wouldn't mind turning Boyd Field into a Jurassic Park for opponents. Defensively, we try to keep it super, super simple. I think we played like two coverages here tonight. And offensively, we, we got five guys who can touch the ball, six guys who got the quarterback. We try to spread the ball into everybody. 30 schools in 30 days, brought to you in part by Osmond Flooring and all things exterior in Athens.